Welcome back everybody. Now for a segment brought to you by First Student Transportation. If you guys are out there looking to re-enter the workforce, maybe take on a job in retirement, or just looking for a new opportunity, you might want to consider joining the team at First Student. They offer flexible hours, industry-leading training, and in a safe environment, and they're currently hiring for various roles. So I recently dropped by their training center to learn more and to see, as we've been telling you, yes, if I had what it takes to become one of their newest drivers. At First Student, it's a real team effort and overall a terrific place to work with lots of room for advancement. It's absolutely wonderful here. We treat everybody like family. We have competitive wages. We have a lot of bonus incentives going on. They can train you to become one of their drivers. It's a very easy process. It takes about four to six weeks and it's just like getting your permit to drive a car. You remember how you got your permit to drive a car, right? And we teach you every step of the way. You know, April, I feel inspired right here today uh, by you and the team at First Student, and I've already mastered one vehicle, so how about another? What do you say I get trained to become your next Driver of the Year? We're going to give it a try. All right. You think I'm going to do okay? We're going to give you the same opportunity as we do everybody. Let's do it. I'm going to look great in one of those vests. Come on. With that, it was time to begin my training with my teacher, Kim. It's not as difficult as it seems sometimes. Uh, don't let it seem overwhelming at first. You might feel overwhelmed. Just listen to what I tell you and follow my instructions. I think you're the one who's going to feel overwhelmed. <laughs> no, you'll be surprised. You know, Kim, before we get started, as long as we're here, seeing as though I'm soon to be joining the team, what do you say we rename the company now that I'm here, just like that? Let's get going. Try it. Well, Brendan, the first thing I want to introduce you to is the three points of contact. Very simple. I want to make sure you hold the handrails on both sides and one foot on the steps as you're coming into the bus. Do you think I can handle this? Two handles. I hope you can, kid. I'm following Kim's lead. Here we go. Two, and up we go. Oh, I like what you've done with this one. Step number one, get comfortable. I think you might be sitting just a little too close to that stairwell, You know, Brandon. someone with a massive and impressive physique like mine needs to be comfortable behind the wheel. So you taught me there's a few things I need to be aware of, correct? Yes. So you can adjust that seat forward and back with your left foot, okay. or you can go up and down with your right hand. So I'm going to come up a little. There okay. we go. This gives me some good height. Good. So I can see the road and the terrain in front of me. Absolutely. And this is one sends me back. Ah. Yeah. This is much better. I'm going to give you the key. You're going to need the key to adjust your mirrors. Mirror adjustment is very important in driving a bus. So I can make sure that my hair is perfect. Yes, Brendan. We wouldn't want a first stud to not look perfect. <laughs> okay, so once the side mirrors were adjusted for safety, up next, the crossover mirrors. Can you see those students out in front of the bus? Mm, I don't think I could perfectly right now. So that means something needs to be done. Correct. We would go out there and adjust that mirror. Okay. okay. Well, you know, I have people to do things for me. So if the one on the outside needs to be adjusted, perhaps someone could do it for me. We would. I'm we'll a... leave you in the seat because this is for your comfort. I'm a very delicate television star. With my seatbelt on, it was time to get the bus started. In three, two, ignition. <laughs> He's already yeah. stolen. I think I failed the class. After getting it started, it was time to see how I would do on the obstacle course. We're going to take this baby for a spin on the obstacle course. See you kids at the commencement. Mission control ready for launch. And then give this a push. Yes, please. And we're off. You think maybe I should slow down? Once I got rolling, I felt pretty comfortable making the turns and keeping the bus straight on course. And we're gonna have to discuss a few things. My time off, and of course, whether or not this bus can make it through a Dunkin' Donuts drive through Great job. Is it time for my break? Kim, I don't like to brag, but I think I've really mastered operating the bus. So what do you say we pick up a student now that I'm an expert driver? Hit that amber switch and let's go. I think there's one right there. Let's pick him up. He looks rare in the go. Stand by. The bus is approaching.
Look at this, Kim, our first passenger. Hello there, young man. Good to see you. Okay, hey Kim, we've got our passenger. We're ready to go. This really would be a great career for anyone. I can't thank you enough for showing us around. Oh, you're welcome, Brandon. But doesn't that guy look familiar? I know who that is. Hey, kid! I'm gonna be late. I need to be there by nine. I knew where he's headed. <laughs> what a horribly behaved student. And by the way, I call this first student chic. What do you think? As we said, they offer competitive wages and even some bonus incentives in certain cases. It really is a team atmosphere and a great place to pursue a career. And the driver training process really is a fun one that you can easily learn. Hey, if I did it, you could do it. This segment was brought to you by First Student Transportation. And if you would like additional information and even to apply yourself, we have links to First Student right now at roadshow.com.